Please be seated, everyone. Well, we're over halfway through Lent. This is the fourth Sunday of Lent, and for many, many years, for centuries, it's been called Refreshment Sunday, and sometimes, more often, called Mothering Sunday. And it's the day when people would go back to the church where they were baptized, their mother church, to celebrate the day. Now, some of the children who are going to be admitted to communion today were baptized in this church. I'm looking at one, Amara. You were baptized in this church, do you remember? Yes. <laughs> and Phoebe, who just read so beautifully for us, you were baptized here. And Caitlin and Haley are going to be baptized in a few minutes, so this will always be your mother church. And for some of the others, for Lara and Theo and for Saxon, it was a different church where you were baptized, but this is the church where you're being admitted to Holy Communion, so it will always be another mother church for you, one of your, a part of your family. You belong here in this church. Now, when we just heard about um, the reading from Candlemas, really, it's the reading we would have had, although it would have been longer, if you'd been able to come on Candlemas for your admission to Holy Communion, as we normally do every year. We celebrate on that day Jesus being taken by his mother and father to the temple, their mother church, if you like, where they give thanks to God and offer Jesus to his father. And so... That's, a, that's already a setting a model for us because really what Mothering Sunday is about is where we belong, the place that welcomes us for worship, our mother church. In recent years, of course, the, tra the greeting cards companies have turned it into Mother's Day and we give flowers and chocolates to our mums and of course it's a very good thing to be thankful to our mums. As a mum myself, I quite appreciate having lunch made for me and getting some flowers. That's a very nice thing, but the purpose of the day is to celebrate the church as the mother of us all, the place where we are all welcome, where we belong, where none of us is the host, Jesus is the host, Jesus welcomes us, and this is where we are meant to be together. So what a wonderful day for us to be back together again. The American poet Robert Frost said once that home is the place that when you have to go there, they have to take you in. I always think that's a nice little definition. Most of us, thank God, have a home where they will take us in. But even if our earthly home isn't a place of welcome, the church home is a place where they have to take you in. We all belong here. Nobody can be turned away. Jesus welcomes everyone. He welcomes us today. Again, after many months of starvation from the sacrament, he welcomes us back to the table of the Lord, the place where we receive the bread of life and where our children today are going to be welcome to receive it for the very first time. So I hope you will always remember this day and remember that this church is your mother church and that all of us will feel today that we're back home together. And if you pick up the magazine that's been prepared, you'll see that the front cover is a reminder of that welcome home from mother church. <laughs>